Hi everybody, subscribe to my daddy's channel and go to Quamstool 8 and click the thumbs up and click the bell and subscribe. Alright everybody, today I'm going to be showing you a quick update from Cinema 1.3.4 to Cinema 1.3.5. And this is for everybody that just has 1.4. It's going to try to auto-update, but it probably won't work for you. But I'll show you how to get through that. All right. You'll see this right here. For now, I'm just going to push cancel. And it shows you what's coming up on the new version, which is 1.3.5. They fixed some real debris. They fixed sound problems. They did a lot of other things, but it won't auto-update. For now, I'll just push cancel. Let's just go through this real quick. From the left, you got the TV shows. Right now, it's on what's airing today. You can push the little triangle right there, and you can get what's airing today. You can get top rated, you can get popular. Animation, drama, comedy, western. I just scroll down and let you see what choices you can look up first. Hulu, Amazon, Netflix. Let's push that one. All right. Got some Netflix choices. All right, let's go back up to the left. Then you have your movies. Right now they have a new Christmas list right here. You can also go to popular. You can go down to now it's playing, upcoming. I'll just go down, new HD releases. I just got one for now. Oh, there they go. They popped up. Drama, horror, action, comedy, westerns. I just scroll down let you see what choices they have. TV movie. Let's just pop that one real quick. Okay. All right. Also in the movie section, they actually play a movie. Let's just go with one. You'll push it. That'll come up, just push down once onto the play. And then you can pick, go ahead and pick play, or you can open it with different choices that's on your particular device. I won't push into any. Next thing you know, well, let's go back up to TV shows real quick so I can show you that. Scroll down to Family Guy. Let's say you like it's one of your favorites. You can just push this heart right over here to the right, and it'll fill in and it'll save the favorites. Let's go back. Let's go to the top. And right there, you'll find your favorite list right here up on the movies. See, I pushed super I push Family Guy and I also pushed Supergirl earlier. You can also have in history anything that you pressed on. If you download anything, you can go right there. Let's go into settings real quick. You can choose your default player. Right now, mine's on cinema, just regular. You can pick Yes Player, MX, VLC, whatever you have on your system. You can change your poster image size. Show aired episodes only. Show HD only. You can auto play. You can auto play here and you can also auto play after you choose. It'll be in the top right hand corner. Shows you can have Real the Brig and Track TV. Change your subtitles. Everything's pretty standard. Now get out of here. And right like I said, this was Cinema HD 1.3.4. Let's get out. Let's go back in it. You'll see this screen come up. Most of you will try to install it. I'll go ahead and press install, show you what happens. And I'm using a fire stick and I'll try to install it. App not installed, no problem. Go down to done. All right, go up to the top right here. Go over to settings, go down and over to applications. 
Go down to Manage app Installed Applications. And then just find your Cinema HD, which is right there, version 1.3.4. And I'll just uninstall it. Now that it's uninstalled off my system, I will now show you how to get everything from scratch, the new version, 1.3.5. All right, everybody, to get Cinema HD 1.3.5 from scratch, first of all, you can bypass some of these steps if you've already done them, but I'm going to do it like you're just now starting out. All right, first thing, let's scroll over to the right to settings. Let's go down and over to My Fire TV right there. Go ahead and press it. Go down to developer options. Press that option. Make sure you turn on your ADB debugging and also turn on apps from unknown sources. Once this comes up, just press turn on. All right, press your home button. All right, next thing we're gonna download is download. Go over to apps right here. Go down over to the right to categories. Then scroll all the way down to utility. Once you're in, you'll see download right here as your second option. Go ahead and press it. Then press it again to download. And as always, if you find this video helpful, please subscribe. All right, it's ready. Go ahead and press it to open. Once you see this screen, just press OK. First thing, always go over to your left to settings right here. Go ahead and press that. And then enable JavaScript. And are you sure? Just press yes. All right, now you can go back up to home. What we're gonna what we're gonna download right now is APK time. If you already have it, you can bypass this. But for those that don't, we're gonna type in apk.com, aptime.com forward slash apps. I'll go ahead and type that in. Once you get it typed in, go ahead and press go. Once you see this, just press OK. And you have three choices here. You can press either one, the black, the orange, or the platinum. I just press the platinum. Once that comes up, go down and over to your right to install. Once it's done, go down and over to open. All right, we can just stay right here at top APKs. Just go ahead and press it. And everything's in alphabetical order, so just scroll down. There's the Cinema 1.3.4. Now the updated version, which came out on the 12th, is 1.3.5, and you'll go to that one. Then press download. Once that comes up, go down over to the right to install. All right, once it's done, go down and over to open. There you have it, Cinema 1.3.5 on December 12th. All right, choice is yours. Thank you. Three. Do not get a swap.